Stone Carving Art. A small stone is engraved with layers of history. The art of stone carving was born in the early days of mankind. It is silently telling the fancies of human beings for thousands of years. On the east bank of the Min River, in the south of Lushan City, Sichuan Province, a 71-meter-high Buddha statue has been standing quietly for more than a thousand years. The surface of the Buddha has been covered with traces of time in the wind and the sun. However, this stone Buddha, built in the eighth century, is only a latecomer to the art of stone carving. As early as the Stone Age, the upper cavemen polished and pierced the stones for decoration. Since then, the ubiquitous stone has become an excellent material for carving, and the stone carving art hereby emerged. Chinese stone artists. Carved in accordance with the natural texture and color of the stone, which is the key to the final shape of the stone carving, they select a piece of good-looking stone, and after designing, chiseling, polishing, and oiling, the artists finally take off the rough coat of the raw material and turn it into a smooth and round work of art. Look at the intensively vivid chrysanthemum stone carving. The crystal Shoshan stone carving, and the magnificent Dazu stone carving. Pieces of stones in the mountains are transformed into various shapes by the craftsmen to achieve a unity of nature and craftsmanship. The master craftsman uses exquisite skills to carve the stone into a work of art. Stone carving is the art of creation and rebirth. Which silently carries the eternal memory of human and nature.